Hello all, unboxing time. Get to it. I'm waiting for Home Depot to send me a, I need another thing of smoked glass for the bar. I sent the, the wife and the stepdaughter to Home Depot since they were out. And the, supposedly the guy at Home Depot didn't have it and was trying to sell them a hundred and some dollar piece. And I'm like, I look online and they had six of them in stock, so I'm waiting for them to call me back. Because I bought one. For 14, after taxing, it was 14 bucks. But let's get this unboxing done. Ooh. I love cards. Marcus Allen. I think I have his rookie card. I got so many cards, though, it's ridiculous. I have to one day actually go through all my cards and see what I actually have and what I actually need. Because over the years, I bought Buku. stickers but let's see all the one two oh there's another box in here I'm wondering oh wow good the wife can use this box as a Let's see what's in the <laughs> they had and sent a bunch of toys. I have to yell for Keegan. I have 5,000 count boxes filled with cards. It's like ridiculous. Commons. From all the years. Ooh, cool. What is this? A dino. Ooh, the kids are going to like Keegan's going to. Oh, either Keegan or Gigi. Luca. Motorcycle. <laughs> Luca. I can remember. There was a time when I watched ooh, that movie so much. I think I watched it in one day seven times because of Keegan. Oh, this is cool. I don't know what this was from. The unicorn pushing the Lightning McQueen toy. Maynard! But this has got to be my secret life. Of, was it a secret life of pets? But let me just get to the comics because I actually have more to take upstairs. So let's get this. I don't want to cut deep. Knowing my luck, I'll cut a comic. My dad came down the other day, and uh, we did some work behind the bar, because I had all this already done by the time you get. So we did the work behind the bar, cutting the, sh cutting the two shelves, and then uh, we watched 
a movie about, uh, it's called Narvik. It was based on World War II. Uh, it, was it was a Norwegian film dubbed. Here's the stack. I bought Bloodbath 1 and 2, which is where the Bloodlines thing ends. So, I got that done. My copy of Justice League of America number 69 disappeared, so I got a replacement. First Doomsday. Then I got uh, Superman number 322. Fighting the Parasite. Then Martian Manhunter Annual number one. Then for... Okay, I want to keep all these separate. I got Martian Manhunter issue zero. Issue one. I had one I had one issue for this series, so issue two, issue three, and issue four. Uh, I've got the last issue, I think this is the last issue of yeah, of Hawk and Dove Volume Three. So I said then I needed two issues for Dr. Fate. I got one of the two issues I needed. I got Dr. Fate number 32. So I'm down to needing one issue and I have Dr. Fate finished. I picked up uh, a Legion uh, number 91, issue 31. Lobo and Shazam on the cover. Uh, got a Starman 38 for the first series of Starman. Uh... Steel issue three. Then let's see. A nice run of Batman Chronicles number eleven, number twelve, number thirteen, number fourteen. Oh, number 15 is an all team up issue. Oh, here's uh, yeah, here's another Legion uh, annual, number two. I also got uh, Hawk and Dove's annual, number two. Justice League of America annual number five. Legion of the Superheroes number 16. Birds of Prey from the New 52 number one. Then let's see. These are all Birds of Prey issues. I got the Heroes Return to Fantastic Four number two. Conan the Barbarian number 157. Uh, and there was a couple more Leg Legion of Superheroes number seven. 
and number nine. Then free comic book date, Suicide uh, King Shark. Free comic book day, Batman Special Edition. Then I got uh, Scooby-Doo uh, Special Collector's Edition, New York Post Exclusive, where the mystery disorder means we have the Rat Fink. Then I got Justice League number 44, variant cover. Batman, I think this is volume 3, number 97. Brightest Day, The Flash, number 7. Number 3. Batman Eternal, number 28. Number 23. Justice League Europe, annual number two. It's an Armageddon 2001. X of Swords Valiant, Variant Edition. This is number, what number is this? Don't know, it's just part 11 to 22. Then I got Uncanny X-Men 426. Weapon X number 24. Marvel Knights Spider-Man number 17. Daredevil the Man Without Fear number 502. X-Men Gold, number 27. X-Men Red, number 11. Weapon X, number 25. I didn't know I bid on this because I already have it. Uh, she Devil with the Sword Red Sonya number four. Maybe I did. I have to go see if I need it or not. Uncanny X Men number 14. And let's see what this X Men. X Men Gold number 17. Stephen Niles, The Possessed. Captain America, The Extremist, number seven, number eight. Number 10, number 11, number 17, number 21, number 22, And number 23. Now, what's this? Free New Frontier. It's a newspaper. Or is it a post? Oh, it's for the Watchmen.
I'll have to put that away. Uh, I got Doctor Strange number 75. And, well, you can see there, I got that one. And number 45. Then I got Armageddon 2001, which I have both of these. But this was a lot. Some of those Armageddon annuals I didn't have. But I got number one. And number two. I got Hawk World number 15, number 17, number 21, and annual number 2. Now I can go with all these Birds of Prey, which are in really no specific order. Uh, issue 59, issue 58, issue 100, 101, Issue 32, 33, 34, 35, Issue 37, Ted Cord, the Blue Beetle. Then, uh, well, okay. Issue 31, Issue 22, Issue 23, Issue 25, and the final issue I got picked up was Issue 29. And that goes for this run. This haul, this unboxing, which stuff's got to go in the garbage, and my legs are hurting me. They're both numb. Ow. But that does it for this edition, and as always, I thank you all for viewing and subscribing King Joe Outward.